The Bachman hitch is a popular climbing hitch tied around a carabiner. The carabiner is used as a handle to move the hitch up the rope. Do not use the carabiner as a tie-in point. When the carabiner is loaded, the hitch does not grip. First we show you a clear instruction video on how to tie the Bachmann hitch. And then we show you with clear step-by-step -step pictures how to tie the Bachmann hitch. Alright, let's tie the Bachmann hitch. To tie the Bachmann hitch you need a carabiner and a Prusik loop. You can make your own Prusik loop by using the double fisherman's knot. Attach the carabiner to the Prusik loop. Then lay the carabiner against the climbing line with the gate facing away from the line. Make sure that the Prusik loop lays over top of the climbing line. Then we start making wraps around the climbing line in the carabiner. You will need around 4 wraps but this depends slightly on the type of Prusik cord being used in combination with the climbing line and some various factors. Always check how well the Bachmann hitch grips before fully committing to it. It's recommended to use a Prusik cord that is half the diameter of the climbing line. If your carabiner uses some kind of manual locking mechanism, make sure you lock the gate. Tie in with the Prusik loop, not with the carabiner. And there is the finished Bachmann hitch. Don't worry if this was a little too fast, because we will now show it again with clear step-by-step -step pictures. The Bachmann hitch step-by-step. -step. To tie the Bachmann hitch you need a carabiner and a Prusik loop. You can make your own Prusik loops by using the fisherman's knot. If you don't know how, then check our video on how to tie the fisherman's knot. Attach the carabiner to the Prusik loop. Lay the carabiner next to the climbing line with the gate facing away from the line. Then start forming wraps around the climbing line and the carabiner. You will need around 4 wraps minimum. It's best practice to keep adding wraps till the spine of the carabiner is fully covered. Else the carabiner might start to move in some awkward position and will need continuous tending. If your carabiner uses some kind of manual locking mechanism, make sure you lock the gate. That's all for the Bachmann hitch. If you like our content, please subscribe to our channel and like our videos. If there is something we can improve on, then share it with us in the comments.